welcome back to the channel everybody twitch beard thank you for coming back checking out this unboxing if you are a new viewer please consider subscribing to my channel it is free go ahead and hit that like thumbs up on your way in hit that notification bell hit all so you don't miss out on the review and with that i'll get right into this company so the company i'm going to unbox today is called dead man's beard co owner's name is bryant they are from upstate new york thank you so much bryant for sending out this awesome package of goodies i do appreciate it I went ahead and threw the uh, butters right into the uh, refrigerator as soon as I got it because it did melt on the way here. The come wrapped in bubble wrap. That, that was cool. He puts his dead man sticker on it, which I thought was really cool. Cool little touch. He sent me let's see two butters, four oils. Again, they come in bubble wrap. They come in a mailer. And then you go ahead and do the sticker on them and kind of close them up. Ooh, I might actually be able to save these stickers and put them on something. Look at that. Oh, come on. There we go. Oh, look, I actually might be able to save these. Start throwing them on things. Nice. So, oils come in like this too. So I thought that's really cool too. Right off the bat, I noticed how shiny these bottles are. I think they're really cool, the fact that they're shiny. I like the shininess on the bottles because it's cool to display, especially if you have like lighting in your shelving or whatever, you know, overhead. It's super cool to have, you know, the bottles reflect that light off. Just makes it give it a cool effect right there. Boom, look at that. Shiny bottle. Awesome quality labels right here. These labels are quality. You can tell they're quality. Uh, <laughs> they do take up most of the real estate on the bottle as far as like the vertical part of it. But they do have directions. It tells you it's one ounce. Dead Man's Beard Co. Dead, Man, Dead Man's Night Out Beard Oil is what this one is. And then it gives you the list of ingredients. I like the font that he picked. And the size of the font that he picked to show you the ingredients list. It's very clear. You can see it. Really cool. I like that. I like that a lot. I'm sounding like Jim Carrey there. I like it a lot. Or however he says that. I'm not really good at that, but there you go. <laughs> Social media is at the bottom. <laughs> I think that's really nice that it's big enough for you to be able to see it. <laughs> good color, so it contrasts from the label. Characters are pretty cool. The little skulls, little skeleton skulls. Show you that right there. So I thought, I think that's actually a cool label. The old guy's got a beard too, so that's tight. All right, let's see it. Dead man's night out. <laughs> this is something that Bernie would wear, right? Reeking at Bernie's? Because he's a dead man? No? I mean, well, Bernie only had a mustache, but if Bernie had a beard, I think this is what Bernie would wear because he's a dead man. This is dead man's night out. I like that. <laughs> it's a smooth... <laughs> I get smooth freshness out of it. <laughs> Definitely cologne style. Possibly aquatic. <laughs> I want to say aquatic. And his dropper tops have the little measurements. I've always liked that. <laughs> I get a kick at it. It's cool. You know how much, you know, it lets you know how much you're putting in. Show you the color of the oil. Yellow. There you go. <laughs> That's cool. It's fresh, clean, cologne essence to it. Cool labeling, I like that. All right, this one's called Dead Man's Reserve Spiced Rum. This again has another cool little labeling on it. The characters, they're all skulls with beards. Fresh and clean cologne scent. It says right there, fresh, clean cologne scent. Right there, right here. This one is, again, spiced rum. Looks like he has like a rum drink with orange on it. That's also another cool, cool label right there. Look at that. And like I said, they're quality labels. You can tell that they're good quality labels. Oh, and that's exactly what that is. <laughs> spiced rum. You gotta get that orange in there. Oh, I can smell that, that citrus. 
That's a that's a nice one. You can I could I get a lot of citrus in there. Or orange, I guess you could say. Let's see fragrance oil, blood orange, clove, vanilla. That's what it says on the bottle. If I do get that that orange, that citrus. That's good. It's a solid scent. It's not boozy. Don't gotta worry about that. Good scent right here. This one's gonna be nice putting in the beer. You get that uh, orange in there. Get a little spiciness to it. That's nice. I like that. Okay, let's see. Lemon frosted sugar cookie. All right. I like sweet scents as long as they're not too sweet. Then you're good to go. Again, though, this is nice. I like that. Let's see. So, if the writing would have been the same color as or the same font, then you would be able to see it a little better. Um, you can see it, but still see the ingredients a little better. This one's cool. Look, he's got the skull with the beard. He's got glasses. And he's eating a lemon sugar cookie. That's tight. I like that. That's cool. All right. Ooh, and he puts them on tight so they don't drip out. <laughs> yep, and that's exactly what you get out of it. <laughs> sugar cookie, the lemon sugar cookie. <laughs> and it's not too overly sweet. <laughs> that's nice. I like that. <laughs> I think he could have got away with putting a little bit more lemon in it, but once it's in beer, it could change, so we'll see. Oh, I'm excited for this one, actually. <laughs> this one, actually... Can probably get you into like the winter Christmas spirit, actually, because it is a lemon frosted sugar cookie. So super nice. All right. This one's the one that I'm very curious about. <laughs> Revive and thrive. <laughs> Whew. <laughs> That's strong. <laughs> that is strong. Let's show you the label. This one's got a beanie on them. Little beanie dude. <laughs> but I, yeah, I don't know what scent this is. <laughs> so I'll have to get back to you. It's super strong though. I get like, I definitely get like orange out of it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Get yeah, like a strong <laughs> orange. It's a really strong scent. <laughs> but this one I'll definitely have to get back to you guys on. I, I don't know what profile. I, I can't even really put my finger on it. But super strong. Definitely some orange in there. <laughs> All right, let's see. This one's the lemon frosted sugar cookie butter. Ooh, it's gonna be so nice. Ooh, this is gonna be a creamy butter. I can already tell this is good butter. Oh, lemon frosted sugar cookie. That's so good. Oh, I want, I want to put this in beard already. This looks like a good solid butter right here. I can tell it's gonna be a nice creamy butter, nourishing. I can just tell just by looking at it. That is awesome. And it smells so good. <laughs> that is really nice. <laughs> and he's got grip on his too, a little grip on there. These are big cans too, look at that. What are these? Four ounce cans, but they're the tin ones. So they're wider instead of taller. So that's different. I like that. Different. And he's got the label right here. The guy. Bam. Look at that. Woo. And then the I, the lettering, I think, match, like it, to me, it matches like the scent a little bit. And then you got, let's see, <laughs> ingredients, directions on the bottom part of the can. So that's really cool right there, too. Um, <laughs> tight. And look, you could do this and then turn it. Ingredients, you don't have to do this weird little dance with it. All right, this is the other butter. This is Revive and Thrive. I said I'll have to get back to you guys on what scent this is, but I get a lot of orange and super strong. So we'll see what it's like once it gets in beard. <laughs> oh, this one has, I guess the other one did too, but since it melted, it probably pushed it off. Save it. Oh, man, this is full. I mean, you're getting tons of, tons of beard butter. You're like, it's full. Look at this. I can already smell it just opening the can. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what to, what to put, put like pinpoint on it. I get orange like a lot. It's a strong scent. So this one I'll definitely have to get back to you guys on, but 
definitely looks like some really good stuff. This one's got the most different uh, little character on it compared to all the other ones. He's, he's holding up some uh, orange and lemon. So I think that's probably, probably what it is. It's like a super strong citrus orange scent. So definitely excited to try these. Guys, stay tuned for the review. Appreciate you guys coming back, checking this out. Brian, thank you so much for this. I am super excited. I'm super excited for that butter and that scent. Oh, man, it just smells so good. Like I said, quality, dropper tops, just nice. <laughs> Got the black bottles. They all match. Got black can to go with it, matching as well. So super excited. I think it's a great presentation. I like how he ships it out, bubble wraps everything, make sure it gets safe to you. I will link them down below so you guys can go give them a follow. Go check out their website, maybe order some stuff. But awesome stuff, quality label. Stick around for the review. And with that, guys, I will leave you to the next one. Peace. So make sure that if you haven't hit that like, make sure you hit that like thumbs up button on your way out. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you want to see more content from me. Go ahead, hit that notification bell. Hit all so you don't miss out on any future videos. With that, thank you guys so much. I appreciate your support. Till the next one.